Hey, what's going on, everybody? Here we go. Another simple mod for the Jeep in three, two, one. Here she is, my 2014 JKU Sahara Edition. What's up, everybody? How you doing today? Geronimo here, Geronimo Lifestyle. Today is another Jeep mod day. All right, guys, I'll be running through some mods with my channel here and also be giving you some little adventures overlanding camping whatever it is here on the jeep channel let's move on to the real modification Woo. all right guys ever since i um put on the new rims and tires the back spare tire does not actually fit um on the back on the tire carrier it actually is a little bit doesn't touch i guess because the offset um you could buy these newer um, brackets and everything like that, but um, I got these brackets from Mountain Goat Series. So they're brackets that go behind the actual um, Jeep spare tire carrier, and they're like angled. So instead of just doing one hole, how each one has its each individual holes on the OEM on the actual tailgate. These ones make a bracket so both of them are together to give it a little bit more of a reinforcement. So I already did that. So now this is the second part is putting in the extenders that go to the bumper, that the little bumps stops that are there so that when the tire hits like bumps and stuff, it just kind of bounces off instead of and it reduces the shaking and everything in the back the trunk. Tailgate, which also will help you um, make sure that your you know, mounts don't bend and everything like that. Um, now that I just have 33s, this is what I'm gonna do for now. If I ever go up to 365s or 37s, I'm probably gonna to have to go to um, a new carrier. But till now, budget saver, $50 all together. Let's do it. All right, guys, here we go. This is what it is. Open up the package. We have Mountain Goat Series. This is what it is. It's from the this performance company. It's fun, performance, pretty cool. They give you a little card, give you a little uh, sticker to put on your Jeep if you want. These are the ones that go into, like I was saying, see, these are the bump stops that are right here. So those are too short. So with adding that in, we'll give it that little extra distance, especially for rims and tires that are just like that. So all right, guys, I'm gonna start doing this and then we'll see what's up. All right, so I made my mark here. So basically it's half the stick, so half will be for both. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this and cut it. Halfway each, one's a little higher than the other, it's okay. Now on to the next. All right, now it's just taking this lube that they gave you, it's right here, opening these little tubes right here. Lubing these up. So it'll go in there pretty easily since now you know it's rubber on rubber so recommended by the instructions
go all the way in that's it it's the extra bump stop the extra little bit that I needed all right let me put them in all right so as if you can see these brackets here you see how these brackets are right here they're supposed to be in the inside of the door but for some reason I couldn't do it so I put them on the outside but you can see these are individual and with this bracket it makes it that much more you don't even understand how solid that is so now they're brackets assisting the heavier tire which is not too heavy but now these grommets after I clean these area they come off right right off of there they basically have this little uh, lip here and it comes right off of there so now insert them by twisting there we go that's one the other one the same way all right guys there you go that's what they're supposed to look like nice in my uh, factory one when I put the grommet in, it fell off part. Luckily, I bought this other extra one. So that one's on this side, that one's on this side. Like I said, the brackets, you can see them there, right on there. So those four brackets, they come. They're supposed to be mounted in the inside. I didn't feel comfortable doing it that way, so I did it this way. I believe it's similar. It's still the same thing, going through the same thing. Um, so, and it's only a 35, it's not crazy. I mean a 33. 33-incher, nothing crazy. All right, mount that back and see how it fits. All right, spare tire's back on. See it now, there we go. Nice bump space right there. Perfect. Other side. You can see right there. They're extended on both sides. And now, a lot more stable. All right, guys, that's another small little modification, little things here and there, getting done to the Jeep. Other than that, we'll do a walk around probably soon and see what I've been doing. All right, guys, see you soon. Geronimo, Geronimo Lifestyle, Jeep channel. Peace. Okay, everybody, there it is. Thank you for joining the channel, taking my 2014 Sahara Edition into something new, something to what I've always dreamed of, my Jeep, my four-door, and hopefully you'll like it and all my adventures. See you soon. Peace.